Hi, Tim Yamix here and today I'm so excited to show you another quick tip how to come from this to this just by adding some color to this footage. There's a pretty easy way to color up a scene where you have no deep color information on a scene for example or you have some regions in your scene or some areas where you want to have additional colors which doesn't exist, for example on a sky or a clipped area. With this technique you can quickly reach up the colorness of your footage and it's an easy way. I don't want to show you how to color correct or grade the footage, I only show you as quick as possible the steps how to add some colors to a scene. So in sake of this quick tutorial I've already done the color correction as you can see here and I will show you and explain you the steps on this example. Okay, as first you have to create a serial node. That's our background. Then add a layer node and remember the layer node lays above the first node. That is a serial node. Okay, now select the layer node and mask a region on which you want to add some color. In my quick example I've done it on the sky. Choose a qualifier, select an area or a region. Make sure your selection is as clean as possible. That means look for noise, look for halos and look for aberrations too. I prefer to make a real soft fallout of my selection of the lows and the highs as you can see here. Further I did a roll off on the highlights because I don't want to add much color to the absolute whites. In a professional grading it's important to have clean whites and clean blacks. Just a hint, try to keep this area safe, here for example with this soft roll off. Now go to the open effects library, look for the color generator and drag it on the layer node. Choose your color by clicking on the color field on this effect. Now comes the fun part. Choose a color, in my example a saturated orange, just for bringing some warmth to the sky. Ok, that's it. Next step. Select the layer mixer node and change the blend mode to soft light. Looks better now, but not what we want. Ok, last step. Select the mask layer node and go to the key tab and decrease the gain until it looks as you like. Ok, that's it. Additionally, in my case I'm not satisfied and determined to add another layer with another color. So here I choose a purple color, something between magenta and blue. I also set the mask a bit different so that some parts of my two masks overlap and some parts doesn't. The great on this method is that you can see how the color affects the footage directly. So Move your color around, decide what looks best for you and enter. As usual there are other methods how to add some colors but that's not the topic of this tutorial. My approach for my quick tips is to give you a very quick tip how to do something or to solve an issue. So I hope you learned something and if you want to see more tutorials or cool stuff like this please don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. You are all a great time. Bye.